Health Watch is presented by UMass Memorial Healthcare. Here, caring for you. What is the pill camera and bring me through how it works? It's a device that's just over an inch long and about three, uh, somewhat under a half an inch in, in thickness. It's easily swallowable, it's very slippery when it's wet. So 99 out of 100 patients can swallow it with quite easily. It brings you all the way down. It, it gets all those areas that you were explaining the colonoscopy and the endoscopy just cannot reach in most Correct. cases. So it's the piece in the middle. Um, and it's, as I say, very difficult to get at. The camera is moved forward by the contractions of the intestine. The patient can go home, they can go to work. The only thing we ask them not to do is violent physical exercise. It's very widely used now, uh, both nationally and internationally. Most gastroenterologists have the equipment or have easy access to it. And it provides, as I say, a very nice non-invasive way of answering the question as to where somebody's bleeding from. It helps us make a diagnosis of Crohn's disease. Sometimes it's helpful making a diagnosis of celiac disease. Why is it so important in treatment? If you can see something really close up with, with high resolution, it's like your high definition television, then you can actually say with reasonable confidence that this is likely to be Crohn's disease or this is likely to be an ulcer or it's uh, likely to be a tumor. Why is it so important as a diagnostic tool? It's widely available, it's well tolerated. It's not like a colonoscopy, you don't need an awful prep. We, all we do is to stop people eating and drinking after they've had dinner the night before. So it's, it's a walk in the park.